Hi guys, welcome to the channel, quick general love reading for my friends Taurus, Virgo and Capricorn who are currently single, so let's find out together what's coming through for you in the love arena. So guys, the energy is for you, the chariot, the knight of swords, the four of wands, the two of wands, the eight of cups and the two of swords, energy is for the new person, four of wands, the star, four of swords, the hermit, the hanged man and the sun, our focus, seven of swords and the lovers. The Oracle cards, crossing bridges, taking shelter protected by angels in the flow, wizard of awareness and making a choice. Plus, guys, let's pull an Oracle card to answer this question. Have you already met this person? Yes! Exclamation mark. So, guys, I have to say that some of you may have left behind an important relationship in the past, maybe a marriage for some of you, or a highly committed relationship with the potential to become a marriage, but it's like you have been forced to leave that situation behind because of a betrayal. A circumstance that brought up fights, arguments, discussions, a lot of words, hurtful words, I would say. So, Eight of Cups energy manifesting, plus the Chariot, leaving behind an unfulfilling situation, crossing bridges. At the same time, closed off posture, like the one of the Lady in the Two of Swords, taking shelter, the answers are within. Now you will have another choice to make, an extremely important one, when it comes to the interaction with someone that can see you guys as the perfect match for them. This person has been single for quite some time, the Hermit, which is another energy that can follow the Taking Shelter Oracle card plus the Wizard of Awareness one. They have been stuck in a situation that was about the opportunity for them to find their person, you know, with the capital P. They want a star connection. We can say that considering how the star and the hermit show up together, plus this person gets even the sun, so energy about the courage of a person for me to understand where their inner happiness truly is and how it can be possible to pursue it more and more along the journey. They want the four of ones, so the goal between the two of you can be in common. This person can break silence in order to express an interest in favor of you guys because it's like they can realize that it's time for them to follow their heart. So, they are willing to take a chance, they are willing to see what can happen in favor of the opportunity to build a connection with you. You will be the one with the last word when it comes to this connection, because we have to basically figure out if you are ready to find an agreement with a potential new person. If this one is a friend for some of you, they can be aware of your story in the Romantic Arena and they have been quiet for quite some time, even if maybe they have been nurturing a major interest in favor of you guys. And so, once again, they are willing to take a chance, kind of hoping for the best so, let's find out about a couple of energies. Uh, for you, I want to go for the Two of Wands plus the Two of Swords. Let's investigate the crossroads. And for this person, I want to see the Hanged Man, guys. Because it is a standby and I am curious to find out what can be in the mind of this person if we think about an overall evaluation in favor of 
a new romantic connection. So, what about the crossroads for you? Here we go. Wheel of Fortune, it can be time for you. This can be a lucky break. Also, energy about patience, life cycles and life chapters. If you have known this person for a meaningful amount of time, I would say that trust can be already established and so the Seven of Swords can be an inner fear about a potential betrayal, but if a betrayal was involved in your last important relationship, this does not mean that a new person is going to behave in the same way of an ex that was unfaithful, guys. So we have to be careful with the Seven of Swords because it can even become an energy about self-sabotage and we can miss opportunities because of that. Queen of Swords, this is an extremely productive energy if we think about communication. Brilliant mind, the Queen. She can swing the ace with grace and comfort. We also know that her truth can be different from the one that another person may desire to hear. This person who is already around you is willing to accept a loss, let's say, if you guys decide that you are not interested in a romantic connection. But it seems that they can truly take a step forward and then they are going to see what can happen. The moon, fear factor in this case, guys, the energy plays a role in the Two of Swords and in the Eight of Cups. We have it in the background. You have to dive deeper in the moon energy because it can be an energy that follows the Seven of Swords and so it can be an inner fear, a fear to be betrayed, for example. And we have to be courageous. We have to take a good look at this type of fear because it can hold us back. So if you want success, the chariot, if you want a soulful partnership, the four of ones, this time manifested in the best possible way, this person can be the one that you have been looking for. And maybe they have been around for a while now. Six of ones. You can find your victory if you also find the courage to embrace the role of the warrior that comes back from old battlefields victorious. There can be lessons, yes. We have to make the best out of them, guys. The Wheel of Fortune can spin in your favor, but you have to be willing to... Pay attention, number one, and number two, seize the moment when it is right in front of you. So what about the hanged man? Which is a shift in perspective, a change of mind. This person can even count on the fact that they can offer you something that can make you change your mind in favor of a positive connection. Let's see. High Priestess, silence, intuition and attention to the details. This can be a friend with uh, secret feelings for you guys. And so they have been holding back those feelings. Now they can make a choice to express them. They want to bring those feelings to light because of the sun. Of course, they are hoping to get a yes for an answer. Ace of Wands, new spark, attraction, passion, desire, the lovers at the end of the day. This person likes you. They would love for the connection to take off. And they are thinking about the intimate side of this connection as well. So if they are a friend, guys, there is a meaningful, meaningful level of attraction. Word energy. This is about completion. 
and it's a double-edged sword guys because this person is counting on the fact that they can be your new beginning in the romantic arena but they are also considering the opportunity to get a negative feedback from you and if that's the case this person may even be willing to fade away so if they are a friend there can be the risk to put in jeopardy the friendship because as soon as we express a love interest everything can change chariot guys another um, recurrent energy mirror effect there is a ton of potential but you will have the last word the queen of swords will have the last word the three of swords is about the past guys especially for you we cannot allow our past to hold us back especially if we have already found a way to release challenging situations otherwise they are going to win once again they brought up hurt let's say then we leave those circumstances behind but we are still bound to them because we may turn down offers that can be extremely positive instead so this is going to be a major crossroads for some of you guys you can be protected meaning you can be guided to recognize how genuine this person can be extremely mature truly wisdom patience this person may even be willing to give you some time if we think about the opportunity to evaluate the chance to begin a romantic connection. But you know what? I love the fact that in the Wizard of Awareness Oracle card, we get the Hermit basically, but we also get a wand that can be the Ace. So guys, this person may be someone extremely mature wise indeed but also someone passionate about you they can like you genuinely they can see you as a star partner at least in potential then we have to put in the work you will have a big choice to make guys you can find your victory but you will have to be courageous at least one more time because this can be the key factor for you to release for good a challenging past. Making a choice. Behind one door there can be success and even a four of ones type of partnership. Behind the second door there can be a missed chance guys. And so you will have to choose wisely. So guys, I hope that I made myself clear and this was helpful somehow, some way. If you want to comment, like, and subscribe, it will help our channel to grow. So thank you. And until next time, I wish you all the best. Take very good care of you and I will talk to you soon. Bye.